Hello and welcome to Bear Pit TV. As you'll note, we've actually got a new sponsor for 2019. It is the football app One Football. It's an app that helps you to keep up to date with the latest scores, transfer news, and football news in general. Of course, this video is my first 11. Um, I don't think we've had worse weeks for the best part of a decade, if I'm totally honest. It's been a shocker of a week. We lost to Bristol. Um, it seems that Rowett is on his way out, although he seems to be just, just clinging on. I get the impression, as was the, the national press, it seems, that he will be in charge for Shrewsbury, but it's highly doubtful, or at least quite likely, that he won't be the manager come the Brentford game, which is a very, very weird position for Guy Rowett to find himself in. But that's the position Rowett finds himself in, and that's the position we find ourselves in. My first eleven for the, the Shrewsbury game, it's a really difficult one because it's... I don't really feel like it's an opportunity to, to test the young players because the first eleven is playing so poorly. I purely see this game as an opportunity to, to interject a little bit of confidence in the squad, hopefully get a victory. So my keeper will be Federici because it's the FA Cup and generally that's what you will do. Left back I will go for Indy, centre backs of Williams and Shawcross and right back of Bauer. There's not a cat in hell's chance that Bauer will start this game, but it's my first eleven and that's what I would go with. I imagine some people would be questioning why I'd start with Ryan and Williams in the middle. And I just think purely for the, the, the potential to bolster their confidence a little bit because it is it's pretty rock bottom at the moment. And you'd like to think that we will beat Shrewsbury and any victory is some sort of confidence injection which the team and specifically Shaw, Cross and Williams desperately need. In midfield, left to right, I would go with Klukas on the left. In the middle, I will go with Etebo and Woods. I would have played Joe Allen, but it seems that he won't be fit for the game. On the right, I'll go with Tomins and up front, Berahino and Campbell. That team isn't a million miles off what I would play in the league, bar maybe Jack Butland. Um, but as I've already mentioned, We've got nothing to lose. I don't see the point in blooding too many youngsters in this game because we, we need wins. Admittedly, we're not going to win the FA Cup, but we're desperate to try and create some sort of momentum. And on paper, can't stress that enough, on paper, Shrewsbury in the Cup is a good opportunity, or at least it should be a good opportunity to get a win. Like I say, I'm not holding my breath. This feels eerily similar to the Coventry third round game last year. And... Um, Part of me can't help but think that this might be the final dagger, the final nail in Gary Rowett's coffin.